guys. It's me, Vivian. Big whoopee. <laughs> That's what my mom would say. Well, big whoopee. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, mister. Um, okay, I'm on my way back to O'Reilly's to pick up my uh, panel for my my uh, window thing. Boop, there I am. Um, so, I watched a video, okay? And I'm thinking I can do this, alright? So we'll see if I can or not. Yeah. If this turns out to be as simple as the guy did it on the, the YouTube channel, I'm going to kick myself all over this town of Newport because I figured it'd cost a couple hundred dollars to get fixed. So I just put it off and put it off until I could put it off any longer. Yeah, the tweezers worked fine for quite a while. Yeah. And it's, the tweezers still work good on the, the passenger side. <laughs> so, anyway. But, my side. So, I'm going to go ahead and change it. And why should I change it if I'm only going to be changing the van, hopefully, next month? Uh... Because, you know, my plans have, my plans have changed several times, and, um, my van is in Florida, so, yeah, I'm, I'm waiting to get it, till I get down there. Clear that way, clear that way, clear that way. Alrighty then. Here we go. So, uh, what's going on? Oh, that frog I'm working on? I don't like it at all. I don't know who did it for the picture, but I can't do it to where it looks good. I'll show you what I mean later. Uh, anyway, um, I think the, the feet, the, the feet are the only thing that, that I was having trouble with because it's so small. I can't hold it good enough to where I can see without shaking. You know, uh, so that, uh, they didn't turn out too well. I don't know if I'll make that one again or not. Unless I use larger thread or yarn. That's about the only way I can figure out how I'm going to be able to do it. Because it gets down to six stitches in a circle. And you have to do all this stuff in those you know, six stitches of oi. Oi vey. Well, I am going to turn this off right now. Because, uh, you know, I'm going, getting into town and uh, pretty soon the phone's going to go flying off the... Uh, dash, so <laughs> I'm going to beat it. So, I'll be back. Okay, guys. I'm sitting here uh, waiting on <coughs> O'Reilly's <coughs> to get parts delivered. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this video or not today, because, you know, They told me, well, we're waiting on, on the Sprinter van. And they said, if you see a white Sprinter van, 
uh, uh, come in and get uh, around back. That's uh, when it'll be. Uh, uh, okay. All right. I'm working on a time limit here. Stop! 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 You want to come over here? Come on. Or you want more to drink? Okay. Uh. Hmm. Just a little annoyed. Oh, is that a Sprinter van? It's a transit van. I wonder if that's the same thing. He headed around back. I don't know. I'll wait. Well, I managed to get the dresser drawers out behind me. Managed to get them out to lift my storage spot up. And I was hoping my material was in there, but it's not. And I thought, well, shit. I'm going to have to buy more material. Damn. <laughs> Don't worry, don't worry. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go crazy with the material. Uh, what I'll probably do is uh, slowly look at uh, thrift sto thrift stores and not not Goodwill though uh, for some cotton type shirts or whatever. And uh, and uh, restock my supply. So uh, quilting uh, basically is out unless I can recover those bags somewhere. So um, then it's going to take me forever to. Uh, it's going to take me forever to crochet blankets. So I'm thinking, okay, what am I gonna do? What, how am I gonna do this? You know, um, I've got, I've got four weeks until Thanksgiving. I'm supposed to spend it with Tommy and uh, Shadow, hit the little one, and uh, then we were supposed to uh, go to a flea market and sell some stuff on Saturday and Sunday. Friday, forget about it because everyone's going to be in the, at the mall or Walmart or whatever. So, uh, we're just, I don't know what he's got planned, but <sighs> gives me between now and then. And I figure not breaking my behind, I could probably get one blanket done a week. And that's not very much. It's not very much at all. So I'm thinking, well, all right, should I just... I don't know what I'm thinking. If you guys got suggestions, I, I thought briefly about taking what I, all the things I have and selling them and giving part of the money that I make to the cause. That way they can do what they want, to, what they need to. You know, because they may not need what I have, you know. I don't know. It's just all messed up. All messed up. I made an appointment to get new dentures, so hopefully they won't fly out of my mouth. <laughs> but, um, let me go in here and see if... <laughs> If the well, I'm going to give it a couple more minutes because these guys. Oh, and there's this one guy that helped me first time. I mean, he's chewing tobacco. Okay, I know it's Tennessee, but he's chewing tobacco in a nationwide store behind the counter and spitting into a Coke bottle. Well, come here. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm thinking, I almost, I almost gagged when he did that. I'm thinking, oh, this is rude. I mean, you're behind the counter 
I'm a customer, you're talking to me, and all, all of a sudden you turn around and go, you know, and I'm thinking, oh, he didn't even bother to turn around. I'm thinking, oh, Lord. <laughs> He's a nice guy. He seems nice, but you know, do you really have to uh, chew tobacco? I mean, they won't let you smoke on duty. What makes you think you can chew tobacco? I don't get it. I don't get it. I'd rather, I told my friend, I, I would rather walk into a store filled with cigarette smoke than to walk in a store and see someone spitting chew tobacco into a bottle. It's disgusting. I'm sorry. I mean, the least you could do is turn your back. Just a minute. Turn your back and spit in the in the bottle and then turn back around, you know. But no, I just... Oh, gosh. It's all right, Sammy. It's okie dokie dokie. It's a okie dokie dokie. go wish me luck okay I'm back I am not a happy camper uh, the one I ha one I wanted and needed is twice the amount of the one that I had before which has more shit on it okay so I'm standing in line and this guy says is that your Chrysler out there? I said, yeah. He goes, uh, I'll buy it from you. I go, I said, but it has over 250,000 miles on it. And he said, that doesn't matter. They, they're still good vehicles. And I'm thinking, okay. <laughs> so I'm thinking, I got his number. And he said, if you want to wait a minute, I'll be out in a... In a in a minute, we can talk more. So, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, here he comes. I'll see you. Okay, see my ducks? I got my ducks in my van. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, you're supposed to slip it under there. Did it break the card? Hold on. Hold on. Gee whiz. Okay. Let me get my seat belt off first. Alright. Okay. I got that against the, the wheel so I won't shake. So. I guess I should have gone with the screwdriver. Yeah, little bastard. Ugh, come on, come on, you little thing, you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. So I gotta pull this plug out, and apparently this plug. And hold on, let's we'll see if I can do it. Okay. They said it's easy to take out. Oh, yeah, that was easy. How about this one? <sighs> oh, fucker. Come on, you rat bastard.
Come on. I'm sorry. There's nothing to look at. <laughs> I'm sorry. Come on. I can't get this other one out. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Why aren't you coming out? I don't know why. Oh, there it is. There it is. Ah, ah, success. I got the old one out. Woohoo! Ow. Threw it on the floor and hit my ankle. <laughs> All right. Let's see. All right. Now I'm going to plug the blue one in. Oh, that doesn't even look the same. Okay. Well, you know what? I got to plug this thing into, into here. And the other one into here. here. <laughs> See if I can... They don't give me much uh, wire space to move around. Okay. All right. All right. I'll do one way or another I can do this. Snap in, snap in, snap in. Are you snapped in? I don't know. Where's the other little wire? No. Oh, yep. All right, now you snap in the other one. It snapped. Did you guys hear it snap? Okay. I didn't hear this one snap, though. But let's turn on the car. Okay. <gasps> it works! <laughs> Praise the Lord, it works! Yeah! I have succeeded! <laughs> Does my lawnmower work? Uh -huh. Yeah, they work too. Holy shit. Yeah. Done. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I am so happy with myself. <laughs> well, after all that heartache and let's see. I went there at 1.30, I think. And, uh, and now it is 4.35, and I got it completed. Yeah! <laughs> what, what? Now I just got to remember to close my window so it doesn't run it, okay? And not to manhandle my little buttons here. Then, then I'll be fine. <laughs> oh. Ah! The guy that offered to buy my van? No, it wasn't my van. He was one. It was another Chrysler in the parking lot. <laughs> he said, yeah, but mine didn't have a sunroof. I said, mine doesn't either. And he goes, well, I thought, sure, I saw one up there. I said, no, that's my solar panel. And he goes, oh, I could have sworn it was a... Well, it was on the other Chrysler. <laughs> so, anyway... $77, and I was quoted 40 and they said, yeah, but that's a different, that was a different one. I'm thinking, no shit, Dick Tracy. It was a different one. Yeah. Oh, it looks so pretty, so nice and clean. Ooh, oh, now I'm going to have to clean that mother over there. Mm, that's okay. It's not that dirty. Not that dirty. Okay, uh, I, I, this has been a mess and a half, and I'm sorry, but I actually got something accomplished today. Woo -hoo, what, what? <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm so happy with me. <laughs> so, you guys, oh my God, 
you guys take it easy and take the long way home, okay? Woo-woo.